With doubtnet, get instant video solutions to all your maths, physics, chemistry and biology doubts. Just click the image of the question, crop the question and get instant video solution. Download doubtnet app today. Hello, we are given another question and the question says a body of mass 2m moving with velocity v makes a head-on elastic collision with another body of mass m which is initially at rest. Loss of kinetic energy of colliding body is what? So, loss of this mass 2m is what? Right? So, first of all, uh, let's say the initial kinetic energy for the mass uh, for the block having mass 2m is equal to half into 2m into v square, which is equal to m v square. Right? This is the kin initial kinetic energy. Now, collision, what? How is collision? So, this is of mass 2m. And here it is mass m, which is at rest. So it is moving with v and they collide with each other, right? So after that, what happens is we can consider that it travels later on with v1 and this travels with v2, right? So what we can say is that we can uh, conserve using conservation, law of conservation of momentum first. Right. In each and every type of collision, momentum is always conserved. So it would be 2m into v would be equal to 2m v1 plus m v2. Right? They are all in the same direction. So it would be equal to v equals v1 plus v2 by 2. So from here we can write v1, uh, v2 to be equal to 2 v minus v1. Let this be first equation. Now, using conservation of law of conservation of energy, right here. So, what we can say is that initial kinetic energy was half 2m into v square was equal to half 2m into v1 square plus half m into v2 square. So, this is equal to v square, which is equal to v1 square plus v2 square by 2. So, this is our second equation. Now, we will substitute this equation in second equation. So, we get v square to be equal to v1 square plus half into 4 into v minus v1 the whole square. So, this would be equal to v square equals v1 square plus 2v square plus 2v1 square minus 4v v1. Right, so from here we get the value that is v three v one square minus four v v one plus v square is equal to zero. That is what we get from here when we solve. So what we do is divide the whole equation by v square. So it would be three v one by v the whole square minus four v one by v plus one equals zero. So we can now find the e solution to this equation right so it is a quadratic equation so v1 by v can be written as plus 4 plus or minus root over of b square that is 4 square that is 16 minus 4 ac 4 into 3 12 into 1 that is 12 whole divided by 2 into a that is 6 so this would be equal to 4 plus or minus it would be 2 by 6 so, either it gives the value that is v1 equals v or v1 equals v by 3. This is, are the two values that we get here. So, this is not possible because it cannot have same, in a, uh, same velocity even after a collision and transfer of energy. So, this would be the solution to this v1. So, we can write that the final kinetic energy for 2m mass would be equal to half into 2m into v1 square that is v square by 9 so that is equal to mv square by 9 right so now the loss that is delta kinetic energy would be equal to the loss so that would be equal to k initial minus k final which would be equal to mv square minus mv square by 9 so that equals 8 mv square by 9 so that means 8 by 9 of original 8 by 9 of mv square that is equal to 8 by 9 of 
initial kinetic energy, right? So our answer would be 8 by 9 of its initial kinetic energy. That is option D. Thank you. For class 6 to 12, ITJ and NEET level. Trusted by more than 5 crore students. Download Doubt and App today.